Isabel, what are we doing for maths today? Um, times tables. Times tables. So we've got two digits by one digit. Could you have a go at it? Two times three is six. And two times twenty is forty. So the answer is forty-six. Oh, great work. So you can actually do two digits by one digit. Just hang on a sec, Izzy. Isabel can do two digits by one digit multiplication. So is, he, is there another strategy? Can you look over there, Rach, on the screen? As you can see there, I've been working with uh, my Apple Watch to record data of my students, just regular learning interactions. And you can see by using my watch, I can use the dictation function to actually um, record really authentic and valuable data straight to my Google Sheet that I can share with others and I don't have to type or write a thing. I've actually pressed my, my watch twice um, and I'm collecting this really great data on my students, which is fantastic. Let's go over and do a little bit more. So over here, Rach. So Isabel, you've done that. Is there another strategy that we could actually use in regard to solving that problem? Yes, because your two times table is just doubling. Yep. So you could just do 23 plus 23. 46 because it's the same. Okay, just hang on, Isabel. So what I would do with my students is I'd use my watch. I'd record. Isabel can use a different strategy for solving that same maths problem. Press done. And what it's doing is it's sending it straight to my Google Sheet. Um, just a really great way. So if we scroll up here, um, we've got a beautiful, um, rich data that's been categorised that I can actually analyse and I can actually plan a much more effective learning pathway for my students because I'm calculating and recording this really great data and it really, it's as easy as talking to my watch and it's getting loaded up straight to a Google Sheet on Google Apps for Education. Paul Hamilton here, signing off.